All right, so eventually, of course, I would have to give Matrona the UR gear. I've I've used her yesterday a little bit to farm the bird because I still need. I, I it's been like weeks since I gave what Bond's relic. It's been like at least two weeks, and I know that I've been putting too much time into it, but I've been farming. It's been like around two weeks, yeah. I've been farming the bird here and there. And I don't have 30 blue stones again. It's just, the drops are so bad. But reset is right now here. So we actually think a little bit more of farming, you know, have it. So Matron is going to be great for farming the bird. It's just going to make life a little bit easier. And that's what we're doing today. Just trying out with your gear. And I took off Tarmio from her. Because I think, you, I, I do want to have her HP, her hers HP. Hers HP? Her HP, right? Being lowered so that she can heal the team more and more. And I saw on Twitter, and I saw a video on it, and I saw um, one, of the, one of the players I know are really good recommended me trying as well. Um, someone did stage 3 with Matrona without having Green Liz. No need for healing. Just a passive healing for Matrona. And of course they had they had the healing card set, which I don't have. But it's very interesting. So Matrona's healing combined with the card healing is enough that you don't need Liz. Because the thing is that Liz not just heals, she also gives ultimate gauge and she removes buffs. But Matrona removes buffs, so there's no need for Liz on that. Just the ultimate gauge part of, part of it. Uh, would be, I guess, the most interesting. And, I don't know, maybe with Margaret, you don't need that much, you know? You just, with that extra tanking and the extra uh, damage you're getting from Margaret, you don't need to push ults as often as you need with this team, for example. So, I, I tried that out, but I'm not so sure if I'm going to be able to beat even Stage 2 without that healing card set. The healing card set is just so powerful. It's not even fun. I have not got a single good card yet, so that's great. <laughs> Man, my my bird farms are so yesterday I yesterday I wanted to record this video. But just playing the bird, I was just not having it, man. I was getting no rank ups, no power strikes. It was terrible. I guess I'll just waste this because I got no other good cards. This whole time. Um it was terrible. Like the RNG on the I, I swear. They purposely give you worse worse cards in this game mode than any other game mode. I swear, man. Like, the amount of Matrona attacks I get is absurd. <laughs> yeah, you saw, I, I removed um, K uh, King from Galfer's Link and put Tarmio. Galfer is usually the guy who dies first, you know, in any case. So, if there's one person I want to give the Tarmio Link to is him, for sure. Uh, let's do. I guess I'll pop in this heal and this heal just to get a Liz ultimate. And to open up space as well. Mostly to open up space. Okay, we got two rank ups, that's good. And we got a power strike, that's phenomenal. Let's double rank up. Only rank up for now, there's no need to double rank up. Let's do this. Rank up Margaret once. I'll rank her up again next turn, because next turn we might actually go on the Margaret card. That'll be good for the rank up. We got the Margaret ultimate. No, Margaret. Brynhildr. We got the Brynhildr ultimate. And some terrible with names, okay? It's just it's just how it is. And we did get more cards, that's phenomenal. Um, okay. Thinking I might um, just go for the kill here. This will kill. If it doesn't, the ult will. I just want to pass to the next turn. Because we are pretty... We're, we're, we're solid for phase 4 already. Yeah, I knew he was going to kill. I ulted just in case, but I knew he was going to kill. We're solid for phase 4. So long as I have 2 level 3 power strikes, we're, we're good. Like, that's all I need. By the way, Matrona, 
I don't have full cosmetics because I'm waiting. I need like two more days to get a Halloween haircut, but close enough. Um, okay. Definitely don't want to waste that blue card because next turn he's going to remove it. And so I'm going to have to play it again. Um, it's going to run out next turn anyways, but in any case, he is going to remove my uh, my buffs from Matrana. Alright, no power strike, that's fine. I would love to get one though, just to reassure that we're going to complete this. Just for reassurance. Oh, he's pushing the kill on uh, Liz, huh? Interesting. When I have... <laughs> when I have... Freaking, um... Tarmiel Link on Matronan, he attacks Galfer. He's, he's out of Galfer, right? When I don't have Tarmiel Link on Galfer, he attacks Galfer. When I put Tarmiel Link on Galfer, he doesn't attack Galfer. Okay, I see how it is. I see how it is. Okay. He might remove the buffs next turn. No, okay. Um, this is good, actually. We're gonna finish doing this, this, this. And we're gonna do a level 2 rank up. I didn't bother ranking up the cards that I was attacking with because I knew the ult was gonna kill. Um. We're gonna get level 3 Matrona, which is gonna be good, so she can tank even better. Okay, nice. Um, we're gonna do the Power Strike, and we're gonna heal. Invasion Ado! Nice level 3. Stage 1 I've done so many times, it's like... I mean, it's stage 2 as well, like, it, it comes to the point where I just know exactly what's gonna happen, basically. So, the thing about stage 2 though, right, is that I swear my, my golfer is bugged. I see people beating phase 3 even, um, without taunt, like, with, with freaking... Let me go for this one as well, because I'm... Quite certain I'll be fine with uh, these and the ultimate next turn. With Kusak, so no taunt, Galfer taking the hits and he doesn't die. My Galfer takes one hit and dies. Like, <laughs> my Galfer is bugged, I swear. I swear he is. Okay. Well, we're good. Phase one or stage one, easy peasy. Of course, it comes to the point where you've you've beat stage one so many times. If it wasn't easy, I would cry. Crit, please. Thank you. That full heals my team. Nice, nice, nice. And we get. Give me a blue drop. Give me a blue crystal, please. Of course not. Look at how cute she is. Look. Look. She's asleep. That's why I'm not screaming. My girlfriend dumps me the dog. And it's like, you take care of her now. <laughs> like, woman, I need to work. And she's like, I don't care. That's not how we speak. Matron is not fully healed, but that's fine. That's okay. Actually, this is what I mean about the golfer thing, right? People beat this with Kusak, right? So they don't have they instead of so people use uh, Green Galfer, Kusok, uh, Green Liz, and Brynhildr, right? No taunt, and their Galfers survive this fucking th this first turn. Mine doesn't. My Galfer does not survive this. Watch, I'm just gonna show you. No, I'm not gonna screw my <laughs> my whole thing here. I'm going for the Liz ultimate, which is actually a good strategy. And I'm just gonna show you. He doesn't survive the first turn. If I die, it's fine, I'll just reset. Oh, he level 1! Wow, I couldn't show you. 
if he level two, if he does level two twice, I die. I guess just don't get, <laughs> just get level one the forehead. I guess. Um. Okay, this time I have to do this, and I'm gonna waste this. He has almost max ult, ult gauge anyway, so this is gonna hit uh, damage cap. That level one will confidently hit damage cap. Yep, just like that. I'm gonna get buffed. Man's buffed up. Is she gonna die? That didn't look good. Alright. Let's see if I get a blue crystal now. Let me have some volume. I can't hear it again. Blue crystal. The, the drop rate for the blue crystal has to be increased, man. It's like... It is te like 10%, like... Don't kill. Don't kill me. You really didn't hurt. She really didn't crit. I swear to god if I die because you didn't crit. She has max crit chance. Alright. Because if you crit, you bypass that uh, defense. No blue crystals. Yeah, let's try it again, baby. I mean, as a, as in general, because I have the end with max upgraded cosmetics, it's just like she tanks better. <laughs> like you can't do anything about that, you know. Like if you have the end maxed out, and you're gonna and you get like Matrona with no upgraded cosmetics. I'm, I'm gonna put you gear out of the equation for this one, but no you are gear like just bear of course the end is gonna be better but that healing that Matrona provides although you don't see it all the time it is very very good like look at that heal for free no time meal link maybe I should give her time meal link maybe we should have healed more uh, <laughs> what ult should go for? I think I'm gonna go for Guffers. Might as well. Gonna waste that, hoping I get another one next turn. <laughs> oh, I should have attacked with Brynhild there. She's gonna hit damage cap anyways. I did not get a take off a buff, not even from Liz. Not even from Liz. It's fine though. We're gonna take off his Ultima Gauge. Mm. Let's rank up, why not? And I'll attack. It's gonna hit my uh, get damage cap. And I'll attack with Guffer. <laughs> really don't need to heal. Should have got to take off ultimate gauge. I just was really hoping I'd get one because I have two, two take off ultimate gauge cards. Not ultimate gauge, buff. Should take off buff cards. Listen, it's really hard to stay awake when you have someone sleeping right next to you. It's. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, okay. Mm. Why don't we kill him here? I'm going to pop this blue card just because um, the ability he has right now is to take off your buffs anyways. So I'm definitely going to lose it next turn regardless. So wasting a turn here is not that big of a deal. Actually, I'm going to have to kill. Oh, wait, what? 
No, he does have the purple. I saw it. Unless I saw it wrong. Where do you see that? I'm almost certain. In any case. Let's, uh... Alt with you. Let's get Gopher's ult in the way now. I'm gonna alt with you so we derank the cards. Oh, but that's gonna take off ultimate gauge. Um, again, just because... Um, if I don't kill him quick, he's gonna remove my buffs and I'm gonna die, so I'm gonna go full force. But phase two, if he doesn't have the remove buff thing, you can take as long as you want here. Because this phase does not do that much damage to you. Because one of the attacks will always miss. Mm. If he doesn't... It, I'm pretty sure he's gonna remove my buffs. If he doesn't, though... What? Am I stupid? I swear. I saw the purple thingy that removes buffs. I swear. Okay, well, good. Because we now have a lot of space. Am I still kill? Actually, I don't want to kill now. Yeah. Sometimes <laughs> I still like this. I I I beat it all the time. Sometimes I I forget that he actually can get that revive, or he does get the revive on phase two. Okay, we'll kill him again. Okay. We're gonna go for this. You should kill, right? Yeah. That's such a little health, like, even Galfrey's attack kills. Galfrey has, like, max passive at this point. It's, like, not, not a big of a deal. Uh, phase 3, so... I'm gonna do this, pop the level 3, and attack, and we're gonna do this. And we kill him next turn. Wait. Yeah, I'm not gonna do too much damage. Yeah. No, I did too much damage?! You joking? Oh, are you kidding me? I did too much damage. I didn't think the Matrona attack was going to do that much damage. I have no choice but to kill. Okay. That is so unfortunate. Completely my fault. And the following one will be the attack. Would this kill? I think it would. So I'm gonna go for this. If it doesn't kill... Ah, uh, that was a mistake, man. Simple mistake. I just genuinely didn't think he was gonna do that much damage. Jane really didn't think it was going to damage damage. Okay. I know it's a weird choice, but I have to do this. Oh, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> and I do this. After cleanse. I'm gonna full heal. Oh, the buffs that aren't there. <laughs> the level 3 blue card is very powerful. Can I kill? I might be able to kill. I think I will. I think I kill here. Uh, I'm thinking, should I wait one more turn to kill or should I just go for it? I think I'm just gonna go for it. I think, um... 
she will definitely be able to kill. She, he has max ultimate gauge. So in the in the background, Matrona's healing is very powerful. It's really difficult to just demonstrate with one run, right? It's, it, but trust me, other than that first fluke, this is my second attempt, of course, and I just beat it with no issues. It, it's just Matrona is objectively better than the end. And if I get the card set that heals, I'll try with Margaret. Yes! Thank you. The blue stones. I'll try with Margaret. Which might even become easier. So, that's it.